What if I told you that I have the secrets of good luck? That I could tell you exactly what you have to do to have such good luck that the next time you're out walking along your street, you look down and find money. That's right, I could make you rich. Well, watch to the end of this video and I'll tell you exactly how. I'm Simon James Green and I'm so fascinated by luck that I wrote a book about it. Life of Riley, Beginner's Luck, is a laugh out loud adventure about a ridiculous amount of bad luck and one 10 year old boy's mission to get rid of it. Now this book has friendship, killer seagulls, school rabbits on the run and advice on why hiding salt in your underpants isn't always the best plan. So if you're aged roughly around 8 to 12 years old, if you love laughing, if you want cringe, embarrassment and loads of awkward moments, then this is probably the book for you. Now, what about that good luck? Well, it's easier than you might think. The most important thing is to learn to expect it. Because when we expect good things to happen, it turns out they often do. Now, the reason most people don't find money on the street is because they're simply not looking for it. They're so wrapped up listening to music or looking at their phones or thinking about what's been going on at school or home that they don't see what's right in front of them. So next time you go out, deliberately spend time looking for money on the ground and you might be surprised what you find. Now, in the meantime, if you want to hear about some really bad luck, have a listen to this. I'm going to read you a bit of the book and we join uh, Riley as he's just plunged down a water slide at the beach. His swimming shorts have come off and even worse, a dog has just run off with them. Gah! I squealed. Now what? Well, I had to get the shorts back. That's what. I removed my bike helmet and used it to maintain what was left of my dignity. I scrambled out of the splash pool where I encountered the dog's owner who was trying to get his dog back. N not very effectively, if you ask me. Come back. Here, boy, he was shouting. The dog was hightailing it towards the beach. Well, what's his name? I gasped. Uh, well, shark. But I pelted down towards the beach, still using the helmet to hide my bits, streaked onto the sand and yelled. Shark! I cried. Shark! Shark! <laughs> so, probably not the best plan to run onto a crowded beach and yell shark, but nevertheless, that's what Paul Riley does in the book. So, this is Life of Riley, Beginner's Luck by me, Simon James Green, illustrated by the brilliant Alexi Bitskoff. It's out now. Uh, so, hope you enjoy it, have fun reading it, and most importantly, be lucky.